Hello and welcome to Medic Educate. This is a new YouTube channel in which we aim to help uh, Year 12s and other students that are looking to get into medicine in the UK. What we're going to do is in this time, due to school closures and other um, different things going on, uh, a lot of people don't have access to quality educational videos and a lot of the ones that are on the internet are either paid for or uh, they aren't specific enough. So what we're going to do is we're going to create specific YouTube videos th uh, for each of the content points. We're going to start with the year 13 content because year 12s will need to start learning the year 13 content over the next couple of months. What we're also going to do is we're also going to uh, post videos on how to get into medicine. So stuff like the UCAT, personal statements, and interviews. And interviews when time comes. Our upload schedule is going to be in the description of every video and it's also in the About Us page. What we're going to do is we're going to post Biology on Mondays, Chemistry on Tuesdays, UCAT on Wednesdays, um, Personal Statement stuff on Thursdays, and anything that you guys want on Friday. So again, we want this to be more of a community fill, and so the comment section is always open, and we will try to answer every one of your questions. How to best use our videos? So what we can, what we'll do is we will we will write all the content on a, like a Microsoft whiteboard like this, and then you can take notes on it and you can pause at any time to take notes. We will have practice exam questions that you can take part and try and answer as we go through them. In the link of in the description of every one of our videos there will be links to Google Drives and websites with a load of more practice papers and textbook references so that you can pad up your notes with um, with the co correct information from the textbook. Obviously our textbook references are going to be based on the Caboodle Oxford textbook. And all of our content is going to be OCRA specific. However, for chemistry, a lot of the overlap between edXL and AQA and OCR is sort of synonymous. And so other examples can use our videos, but just make sure you check your textbook for which bits you actually need to know and which bits you don't. So. Anyone who's now no longer a medic or isn't planning to study medicine, you can switch off now because the next bit I'm going to talk about is how to get into medicine and how we're going to help you with that. We're going to start by uh, talking about, so right now, obviously you're here. One of the important things, the next steps for you guys is always getting work experience because that will be essential. That those requirements might be slightly lax this year because obviously it's harder to get work experience now given all that's going on but still some form of exposure would be useful even retail or charity shop sorry sorry about that Sorry about that. Next steps is uh, predicted grades. And we can help you with that by watching our content videos for the, for the courses that you're using. You can learn all the content that we aim to provide. Next is the UCAP. It's, an, it's the entrance exam for majority of universities and we'll go into more depth on that in our UCAP video. 
um, as someone who scored in the top one percentile in the UCAT, I definitely will be able to give you the tips and tricks to make sure you master it. Next, your personal statement. Why do you want to study medicine? Why are you here? And that is a tough question for most people. So we'll give you the tips and tricks on writing the most concise 5,000 character essay. It's almost an ad for most people that you can physically write. Don't know how to spell right, but, you know, there we go. We'll, we'll change that bit. Um, and then, obviously, then you submit your application. Some of you will take the BMAT in October, or you can take the BMAT earlier, unless you're applying to Oxford, which has specific October BMAT requirements. After that, you go on interview, and so that will happen in about November or December, but we'll give you more information on that closer to the time. Finally, I just want to say thank you for watching this video. Apologies for the bad mic quality. Again, this is kind of being done from home. We just want to help you guys get through this, and we understand that there's a period of uncertainty about what's going on, and we want to give you the support that we can. So thank you for your support, and have a good day. Hopefully you'll come back and watch some of our videos.